When a hysterectomy became medically necessary for Cheryl Higginbotham, her doctor referred her to gynecological surgeon Stuart Mason. I was not really aware of how rare that this surgery was that Dr. Mason is doing. I didn't know that was an option for me. Cheryl was a candidate for single-site da Vinci robotic surgery. That means little or no scarring, less pain, and a faster recovery. And he said with the single site that there'd be less scarring, there wouldn't have all the multiple incisions as the laparoscopic surgery. It would only be through the belly button and that the recovery time was usually significantly less. With high precision, the da Vinci robot assists physicians with minimally invasive surgeries, including the single site. Dr. Mason is the first in the Valley and one of a few gynecologists in the United States trained to do this advanced procedure. Really with single site where it has made the next leap above a, a general robotic da Vinci uh, hysterectomy uh, is that the, both the site uh, placement is smaller, uh, which helps with healing and, and also with cosmesis. It also helps with making uh, less trauma to the abdominal cavity, resulting in a faster recovery as well as a, a smaller incision. I didn't really feel like I had surgery. I came home by lunchtime, my husband and I had lunch, and I did little walking around my house. Having a fast recovery with less scarring was a big incentive for Cheryl to choose the single site procedure at Clovis Community with Dr. Mason. I had my first post-op and he was saying, you're not out of the clear until six to eight weeks, you have to slow down, but I really didn't feel like I had just had this major surgery because I really felt pretty normal. With a single site da Vinci robot, you can be back to work uh, in as little as a week. Um, the recovery time still is, the healing time is still required. However, um, so the vaginal integrity still takes six weeks to heal, but you could actually be back to work in some uh, capacity within about a week. With anything, the bigger the incision, oftentimes the greater the pain. So what we find is that uh, with the smaller incision, um, we're able to decrease the pain significantly. The robot helps fine tune a physician's motions, making it safer for the patient. So the surgeon is performing the actual case. The robot is enacting the movements that the surgeon provides. The surgeon um, is able to get into tighter spaces, better depth of vision. It's not quite to Star Trek levels yet. However, it is a, um, it's a procedure now that uh, patients are safer, patients uh, heal better, heal faster. And for me, that was the best thing I had from this whole experience was that my recovery was so fast. I was able to just get back into being a mom and a wife and you know everything just so much quicker. Along with Dr. Mason's extensive training for this surgery, Clovis Community's surgical team has earned some high marks for its commitment to excellence as well. They have a team that comes out to evaluate your da Vinci program, and it's uh, nationally uh, recognized. Not only did, did they not have anything to improve with the team, but they asked if this could be a site to have other groups observe the team. So um, that's hats off to all the people working here and, and the commitment that this hospital has to uh, their da Vinci program. Dr. Mason says there are a few limitations with single-site da Vinci surgery, such as a person's weight, uterus size, significant adhesions, or previous abdominal surgery. So it really is an individual conversation with your surgeon uh, to see if you're a candidate or not. He's a great doctor, and the surgery ended up being such a breeze. So we're blessed in this area to have him and the hospital. It's just amazing, and I just, I'm very thankful that to have to have it, that it was able to be so quick and easy.